Get ready to breathe new life into pre-hospital care. Discover the power of precision with the Hamilton T1 Transport Ventilator. A game changer in pre-hospital mechanical ventilation, the T1 is high-tech and lightweight. Engineered for the demanding efforts of providers who need simple, fast, and reliable ventilatory support in an environment where every second counts. The era of oxygen-rich, pressure-supported, non-invasive ventilation is here. If you want CPAP with 100% oxygen, you've got it with the T1. Let's say you have an older adult presenting with an exacerbation of COPD where oxygen delivery and CO2 elimination matter. It is finally time to welcome BiPAP into your therapeutic armamentarium. Setting up BiPAP with the T1 is easy because it utilizes the same mechanical ventilation and CPAP circuit. One circuit, three therapies, and so much more. I prayed for the day we would have mechanical ventilators. These ventilators are so intelligent. With the Adaptive Support Ventilation, ASV, folks, the Hamiltons can figure out the lungs of a simulator. Yeah, chew on that. Simulator lungs. They're also great for patients and paramedics. And here are just a few of the reasons why. Mechanical ventilators reduce the provider's workload. Transferring intubated patients downstairs into an ambulance has always been difficult. Pre-oxygenation, pausing on the stairs to ventilate, disconnecting at the ambulance, reconnecting the bag in the rig, and settling in to manually ventilate for the transport can be tedious. Attach the T1 before patient movement to eliminate manual ventilation and interruptions in oxygenation. The Hamilton T1 has a CPR ventilation mode, which offers additional assistance during cardiac arrest transport. In 2022, the National Association of EMS Physicians published the position statement and resource document in the peer-reviewed journal Pre-Hospital Emergency Care, recommending invasive mechanical ventilation for hypoxic respiratory failure, hypercapnic respiratory failure, and airway protection. According to the authors of the Difficult Airway Course, there is high quality evidence that overventilation can harm many patients. The best method to avoid overinflation is to utilize a mechanical ventilator. Therefore, the authors recommend always using ventilators in medication facilitated airway management settings.